Welcome to Code It. Today I'm going to show you how you can get started with the Telstick CNET Lite with this one. And first off, I'm going to unbox it. So let's go ahead and do that. The Telstick CNET Lite have both 433 protocol and the Z Wave protocol. So it can receive and transmit through C Way and it can transmit with 433. So the good thing with C-Wave is that it's a two-way protocol. So if, for example, this sends a request to uh, this plug in switch, this will tell the gateway that it received the command. But with the 433, you can just send it to it, but this cannot tell if uh, it got the signal. So it's uh, more secure. So let's go ahead and look what's inside this box. I will need a scissor. Let's see if I can get that. Let's go ahead. Lift that. And let's see what's inside. Nice. So there we have the actual device and its antenna. So here it says, welcome to a smarter home, your home. So let's see if it's true. I'm just taking this off and pulling out the actual device. There we go. Let me get rid of this. So, the device and antenna for it. Some cables. A micro USB cable so we can get some power to it and an Ethernet cable so we can hook it up to the internet and of course a EU uh, power adapter what else do we have in the box? a quick guide but you will not need this because I'm sitting here <laughs> and explaining everything so let's get rid of some trash let's start by putting this antenna on the device you can do that by just screwing it. There we go. And we can get the power adapter, the power cable, the micro USB cable. If I can get it open, there we go. Let's bring that out. Straight into the port, micro USB port. And plug it in into the EU adapter. Nice. The only thing we need to do now is plug in the Ethernet cable, shove it in. Now this device is ready to go. The only thing we need to do now is get the activation code and write it down so we can use it later on when we activate this uh, on Telus Live. But let's go ahead and uh, plug it in, either to your switch or your router. But in this case I'm going to plug it into my switch. So let's go ahead and do that. So I'm currently beside my switch. So let's start by attaching the Ethernet cable to a Weibull port on either your switch or on your router. And then we just supply it with some power and it should start up. So let's go ahead and activate this on Telus Live. As you can see it starts blinking with some green and red lights. When this one stops flash, it's uh, turned on. So the final thing you need to do now is to activate it via Tildus Live. So let's go ahead and do that now. So first off, go to login.tellus.com and either create an account or just uh, log your in. Uh, I already have an account. So once you logged in, you can go to locations and uh, add a new the location and then you start writing down the activation code that uh, was under the CNET. So let's go and press activate. Give your location a name and it have been added to the list as we can see. That's everything. So I hope everything worked out great for you and you got it perfectly set up if you haven't and you have any problems, 
yes, drop them in the comment section. I will try to help you out. Uh, but until next time, comment below what you want me to do next. I think on my next video I will show you how you can get started with Tetris Live so you can add your devices and start controlling them through your either Testic Duo or any devices. So more coming soon. Ciao!